Hello everyone, my name is Maisha and I'm the beauty director at Sephora and today we are filming from home. I am joined by our Sephora squad member, Jesse. Hello everyone. Jesse and I go way back. You're in where now? You're in Portland, right? Yeah, right now I'm in Portland. Portland, okay. Oregon. Which product do you want to start with today? Okay, in every single video I do, I mention this brand. This is a brand that <laughs> I feel like I don't even have to say it anymore. If somebody's watching this video and they have watched any of my previous videos, <laughs> they will know what I'm gonna talk about. And it is the Youth Three People Kombucha 11% AHA Exfoliation Power Toner. This is my second bottle already. I have dermatitis, mm -hmm. I have dry skin, I have a lot of texture. My skin to put makeup on, it's a process. And this, I use it maybe twice a week and it's Perfect. It just takes everything off. It makes my skin look poreless. It makes me feel really happy. And it has helped a lot because I get a little um, spots here and there. It has helped me a lot with the spots. So this I'm obsessed with. I have a little mini that I keep refilling and I take it with me back when I used to go to the studio. Do you use it at night? I feel like it works best yes. at night, right? At night, definitely. Yeah, I just feel like it just softens the skin so nicely and I really like the smell of it. The smell and the texture. I feel like everything grips so much better after you apply that. I have prepped mm -hmm. clients skin with it and it's just, mm -hmm. I've been really mm -hmm. in love with this brand. Again, just like you three people, I feel this brand has amazing values and the way they source their products from me, it's, mm -hmm. uh, it's major, it's key. My second one is the reason why I have fuller brows and longer lashes. I know it was a Sephora 6, but they both have the same shape and the same color, so I'm just gonna whip them out it, and act like it doesn't. Six. Yeah, they just go together. <laughs> it's yeah, it's just a duo. I mean, if you get one, you should get the other. Grande Cosmetics Grande Brow and Grande Lash Enhancing Serums. I don't know if the camera can capture it. I have officially decided to grow a unibrow. It's happening. <laughs> Happening. It's funny because I have a unibrow that's so light you can't really tell it's there. And really? I don't know why I'm like secretly proud of it. It makes me feel like my brows are fuller. Yeah, you're like, <laughs> look, at my, look, look at my little hairs. Get closer. Look at my little hairs. <laughs> I'm a 90s baby. I grew up in that era where like brows were like thin, like very thin. And <laughs> even though my mom would tell me not to pluck them, I was a teenager and I wanted to do whatever I wanted to do. So I did pluck them anyways and I sort of regretted it. And after I started using Grande Brow, I finally have fuller brows with a unibrow. I feel like the trick is to put it like anywhere where you're gonna like hang out at night so you remember to put it on. That's the hardest part. Yes. It's so easy to do, but you gotta remember to put it on. I actually keep mine next to my bed. So even if I'm tired, I would just like reach out and just like <laughs> put it. I know I play video games every night, so I have a little mini skincare <laughs> bubble. So I like don't forget, it's like right by the outlet by the dock. I'm like, I have to put it there, otherwise I'll forget. We have to play video games together. If you play the video <laughs> game that I play, I'm gonna lose my marbles right now. Okay. We'll we like yeah, we'll 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 trade we'll trade our little friends codes later. <laughs> okay, so let's have your third product. It's going to be the Anastasia Beverly Hills luminous foundation the reason why i love this one so much i i do photography and i take a lot of beauty portraiture right this is one of the foundations that i use that makes my skin look so good even on camera when i'm doing mm -hmm. frequency separation and going crazy zoomed in into my skin this always gets to makes me like it makes me look so healthy so radiant so natural i feel like Formulation is beautiful and also it gets, it gets to last a long time and one of the things mm -hmm. that I'm obsessed with it I got a little training from like the the brand reps that I have in my area You can actually use this under your eyes mm -hmm. as concealer and I feel like whenever I go into summer yeah. shade And I get darker and this is too light this I use as a concealer and it's beautiful. It's gorgeous My next one is a fragrance. It is the seven virtues vanilla woods so good. I love them too. It is. I have my rollerballs here. Oh, I love them so much. I pulled I pulled some of them. Like they're just so good. They're so good to mix too because they're so pure. It's one of our clean fragrances. So it's just like mix away. If you have allergies, like just a great brand. I have two rollerballs and this one, I discovered the brand by using this one. Like this was the first one that I ever tried. I have high anxiety. I'm into things that will calm me down and like soothe mm -hmm. and be like refreshing 
and the first thing that it says like because if you look in the back you might not be able to read it but like it has a little bit of details of the fragrance and it's just like it says best mm -hmm. for alleviating stress and i was like excuse me <laughs> i'm losing you today <laughs> And then it's like <laughs> calming, soothing the overworked. And I'm like, you have, you're talk, you're just speaking my language. I feel like I need you in my life. I know. I think there's like people think fragrances for like a special occasion, but like you use vanilla to calm yourself down. I've definitely used the vanilla woods to calm myself down, or just kind of remind me of home. I feel yes. like I'm not a morning person, so what is it? The grapefruit lime, mm -hmm. like that's a really good one to spray, like on yourself when you're getting ready when you rather be asleep because it just kind of wakes you up Sexy a little bit because uh, it's so light and citrusy so i just feel like fragrance can be a part of your mood as opposed to maybe like lighting a candle like it's on you and you're smelling it so it definitely changes your mood so now you have some makeup for us right i do i do have a little makeup i've been obsessing over these nude stick concealer pencil and the shade is in light three this one i take with me everywhere the reason why I love this so much, it's, this is, I mean, it's shorter than it should be. It has, cause you, yeah, you love it. I've used it a lot, but this is what lives on my purse. I feel like every time I go out and I just, I feel like my under eye coverage, even if I set it, or even if I get to like put the concealer and like have the greatest prep and the greatest set, sometimes it gets to dissipate through the day or just like soften up through the day. And that's mm -hmm. what I used to like give a little bit of light here and there or like extra coverage in some areas or if I eat and I lose a little bit of the coverage because sometimes a girl gotta eat and she doesn't mind about her like she doesn't <laughs> care about her makeup so it's one of the ones that I use just to touch up and the texture is really nice I don't know if you have tried them but they're so nice and creamy yeah color. they're they're really velvety I had them in my kit years ago when they first launched and I just like the fact that it was a pencil so I could put it exactly where I wanted it and I could sharpen it and that's very sanitary like it was really great in my kit to use and the darker ones I would use is like eyeshadow on people oh, so yeah. you can just use them for whatever you want. I get to carry a couple of those pencils and just like work it up and call it a day. We have one last yeah. one. I feel like I pretty much use everything on your list and you're reminding me of some old favorites. Like I haven't used my Nude Sticks concealers in a while, so I'm probably gonna grab those in a bit. I did peek at your one last one and I do love that. I love anything from that brand. So tell us about your last one. I opened the video with this brand. I'm closing the video with this brand. <laughs> <laughs> Surprise, it's you three people. <laughs> this is the Superberry Hydrate and Glow Dream Mask from you three people. This is one of the things that i love using with my first option with the toner i feel like when you use this two together you have the perfect match i have used this a lot because i'm super dry and i also like to hydrate well of course i like to hydrate and dry i like to target a little bit of hyperpigmentation because i easily get scarred and i love just getting to have that nice glow but when I look for a mask to use at night, I don't like when they're too emollient that they feel sticky or tacky. Mm -hmm. This one absorbs so quickly into the skin and it's so nice that I feel like I've been on my second bottle, I want to say, because I just... I just keep reusing and reusing you to the people. That's how I know I really, really love it because I have so many other options that I can try as well. So there you go. That's Jesse Sephora 6. Um, and I always like to ask people in the comment section to leave what their Sephora 6 would be. I feel like it's kind of a tough one to do, but I mean, we all had to do it, so you should have to do it too. It's kind of fun to pick your like <laughs> six ride or die products that you would use from Sephora. Uh, so go ahead and put that in the comment section. And as always, please subscribe so you don't miss any of this fun stuff. And Jesse and I are going to go like pack up our equipment and play video games after this for sure. And we'll see you next time. Bye. Yes. <laughs>